Hi folks, in today's Astroneers Snails video we're going to hunt for our fourth snail type. The Vesania snail should be next. Now here's the planet Vesania. This is the on the exotic planet. Um, apparently the snail there will give us damage immunity. Um, I also hope, hopefully we'll start farming for seeds as well so we always have some at hand to feed our lads. Signal boost is our next mission and then we'll be possibly be doing some farming as well. Signal boost, we have to go over to our exobiology lab and give it another exo chip. Off camera I've been doing a lot of stuff to get the progression of the game up and running a bit more. I've got the big shuttle. So I've already been to Glacio to get some stuff as well, so I've been to Glacio and I've also been to Visania just to get some, I think it was some um, titan, titanium or whatever. But anyway, in the meantime, let's put an exo chip into there. It enjoyed that, did it not? Yes it did. Uh, and now what? Signal boost. Use data log to activate Xenobiology's act thingy tracker. Okay, already forgetting how to do all this. Right, let's have a look. So we've got these two new ones, Visania, and also from Novus, um, which is fairly um, predictable. Uh, so yes, the Visania one um, is a damage immunity, which is insane. Uh, and this one, uh, the, the Novus one, um, it energizes technology when well fed. Um, so basically it provides power. Excellent stuff. Uh, right, we don't need to do anything else here, do we? Nope, uh, we just need to start thinking about going to a new planet. I don't know where we're going to start farming, but I think we still we need, we need mutant seeds, don't we? Which is going to take a bit of time. But I've already got my um, spaceship pretty much set up. I've got a landing pad again. A large oh, hang on. I've actually got my smelting furnace, so let's take that. Uh, I've got a bunch of resources as well, just in case. Well, I don't know what the Visania one wants, because it'll want a special resource, won't it? Because it's a art prick. Also on Glacio, I found the Orn. So yes, I'm not showing um, every single little bit of progression I'm doing because that's just regular game and we're concentrating on the snails. So yes, this um, this large shuttle did take me quite a while to actually sort out. Um, I have got um, a, a better thruster now as well, so I am on, in the hydrogen age. And we are going to Vesania, which is over... That's Calidor on that. That's the sun. I'm trying to go to the sun. <laughs> I don't want to go to the sun. That'd be hot. There it is. Vesania. Previously, when it came to the planet, I landed over to the right somewhere, over to the east. But this should be new territory. Exit. So I don't actually know whether we need a smelting furnace or not, but based on previous ones we will. Uh, but now I need to go and find some shells. Some snaily snail shells. Um, let's see if there's anything special about this. Find and scan its discarded shells hidden on the high hills of Vesania. Um, where's a high hill when you need one? Uh, well, I'm running out of oxygen already. Ooh, I really should have brought my snail friends. I think this time I'm just going to rely on boring old resin. And then I'll make some oxygen filters and we'll all be good. I don't have um, a, a jump jet anymore. It ran out. So I am going to take a bit of extra time. For some reason, some of the oxygen uh, oxygen filters are crafted, crafted blank. I'm not quite sure if that's just a graphical thing or not, but... Hopefully we'll have enough time to go into these hills over here, because these look very hillular. Oh, hello! Um, we actually have got a bunch of titanite as well. Um, is that a snail? That is a snail! So they're red and yellow, and there's lots of them all over the place here, so this isn't going to be too difficult to mop up. As usual, we need to get five. There's one in the pits. There's some graphite, which is quite tasty, because I can do turn them into repackages. And there we go, there's all the snails we ever will need. Right, quickly get back. Cool, okay, so um, we do need to see you, Jimmy. Oh yeah, come on, activate. There we go. Bonus, you, and shells, empty terrarium. Which is right there. So we need, oh, lithium! Raw lithium, and also a lash leaf seed. Alright, well, lithium's going to be a bit of a prick. I believe you can find this on, in caves in this planet, but that's going to be a bit of an arsehole, isn't it? Uh, okay, lash leaf. I think those are the tongs, which we've been passing many, many times. Well, I think I might have dug quite a few of them up. So, there, oh, there's one, there's one, there's one. Really close to the um, the gateway. Right, so let's also, we also need to find some mutant seeds as well, so we can start farming. That really needs to die. There we go. So we have just regular lash leaf seeds. We'll get a couple. Bung. 
and bang. So all we need now is lithium, which is going to be a problem. Um, so I think I'll quickly just sort my inventory out. So if it is raw lithium, we simply don't need the smelting furnace this time. So good job I didn't bother unpacking it. And previous ones have required um, smelted resources. So unfortunately now we need to go down into caves, which means I think the only thing we can do now is start tethering. Uh, which means I do need to find a little bit of compound from over here. See, what I was doing um, off camera when I was actually uh, searching for things like titanite is um, I was using both, well, two of my previous snail lads. Uh, one of them uh, f to actually find uh, rare things um, on the planet and the other one to provide oxygen. It provided to be a useful combination, but as if I didn't actually do that when coming here, so that was a bit of a pisser, but never mind. Um, what do we need? Tethers. Well, found quartz. Which is all very handy. Um, and unfortunately now I've, um, I do actually have to have my drill mod on just so I can actually dig through some of this stuff because it's a bit hard going. And here we are at the very, t very top of a cave. Oh. Another award winning ramp. <laughs> just to find some goddamn lithium. So this may take some time. Ooh, hang on. Right, I've got to remember where I came from. <laughs> found some. Got the lithium. Oh, there we go. Um, get a bit of spare, just so we've got the ability to make batteries. And oh my god, I've got way too much. Ah. There, go, before my hair runs out. Ooh. Um, okay, we're just going to get through here, and we should be fine. I can just see my tethers. Hurry up. Hurry up, lad. Jump! Jump! Bounce! Yes, there we go. <laughs> Phew. Right. Back up the ramp of truth. Right. Okay. Lithium. Raw lithium. There we go. And now we're horning over in this direction. Uh, we, need, we need to take him back to the main planet to scan him, of course. But in the meantime... Let's just do the usual chicken dance. With my thing out. Where's he gone? I heard him over... Oh, Dix is miles away. Ooh. Right. Here's what we'll do. Tether. Oh my... Ugh. I've not even got any tethers. I don't think I have. No. Ow! Lash! Am I right, you? Right, here we go. No, that's the wrong one. Oh, no, it's the right one. That's, that's fine. Where's he gone? Oh, there he is. Seems to be a more of a long distance lad, this. Oh, I've also crapped up my tethers, but never mind. Ha! There we go. And the horn! Where's the, where's the horn gone? Where's the horn gone? Where's the horn gone? It just flew up into the air. Uh, there it is. It really went miles. First of all, let's just quickly... Uh, eyes on lithium, which is completely unconnected to this particular <laughs> mission. And also, some extra bites. Nice. So we need to take the snail back to the mainland and ever, whatever, to silver. But now we can do a little bit of a, a test with Princess. So now, that means I'm now immune to damage? So let's go, let's go and get licked. So I think that blue flash is... Yeah, there we go. I think that's the armour kicking in. So that's not hurting us at all. Apparently you can still suffocate. But... For the moment, I am perfectly... Does that mean you can... Ooh, does that mean you can do um, fall damage negation? Ooh, that's interesting. That means that getting to the bottom of a planet will be fairly trivial. Huh, that's interesting. Lash leaf seeds. Unfortunately, these are not mutant ones. But... Let's see if I can find a couple more and see what we can get mutant seed-wise. They're just regular ones. I am running out of oxygen, so I won't have very long doing this. But I can also see a point of interest to the right. I should go and investigate that soon. Oh, would you believe it? <laughs> In this point of interest, I've just found some lithium. Oh. <laughs> oh, also some hydrazid, which is um, probably a bit more useful to us. Nice. Still haven't found any mutant seeds, though. Oh! 
Research item. Get rid. Is that a mutant seed? It is a mutant seed! Um, okay, found one. Found some that we, we can actually garden with. Both of them are mutant seeds. That was a very good plant. Okay, um, I shall take these back to my ship. So I can um, pack up and go home now, I think. Um, I'll take my pointless smelting furnace. I'll leave that behind. And may as well take a research item home as well. Right, so I left a beacon behind and a bunch of other assorted old tut. And for now, I think we can leave. I forgot the landing pad. <laughs> Damn it. Um, but whilst we're here, we're actually going to pop over to Novus. So I'd, we may or may not need the landing pad. Oh, I think we do need the landing pad. Ugh. Oh well. We've been inefficient, but we've got, the, we've got the fuel to cope with this, so it's not the end of the world. Um, I just need to now s start searching for snails. Discarded shells found inside crumbling stones within the cavern of no caverns of Novus. Oh, it's another bloody caves one. Yet another ramp. And we are into some caves. Now, crumbling stones. Are they a crumbling stone? They are a crumbling stone. Ooh, quartz. And ooh, shell. I don't remember those crumbling stones before. That's weird. I wonder if they're new. Either way, we've already found the damn things. So I can continue doing that for the next five hours. Here's another one. You don't even, don't even need to do that. Galactic Boogaloo. Oh, apparently I've just unlocked an achievement for dancing on every planet. Huh. Um, I wasn't even trying to dance, but dance I did, apparently. Another one. And another one over here. Ooh. Yes, there's one. I am slightly lost now, admittedly. But that should complete the set. There no, would be another one in there, but... Uh, um, slight issue. Where the hell is anything? Oh, that's... I recognise that bit. Yes, there we go. Phew. I recognise some, some minerals in the distance. And that's it. That's how you get the Novus um, shells. Right. Back here. <laughs> get you. And bung... Oh, God. I've run out of space. Um, hmm. Oh, I'll so sod the research item. No good to us. And now we need to go back to the bloody moon. So I could have claimed the uh, terrarium from the landing pad when it was on the other planet, but um, there is actually a... Um, there is actually a mission where you actually um, install a landing pad on every planet, which I may as well go towards. Um, anyway, landing pad, speaking of which... I can go... There. Avoid it. Expand it. And get us our reward. Empty terrarium. Now, presumably... So I've got the horn, yes. Let's, well, let's, let's see what we need for this. Um, we need to go into a thing. Soil, iron, and thistle whip. So, iron. Oh. I did actually bring a bunch of minerals. Yes, we do have iron. But we also need Thistle Whip, and we've been fighting those recently. Um, hang on, that needs to be gone. Unfortunately, they were back on Vesania. Ugh. I'm sure there must be some around here, though. I think we should be fine. Yeah, I can see one up in the air. I'm guessing that's the one, Thistle Whip. Yeah, Thistle Whip. And Thistle Whip Seed. Let's take that with us. I'm guessing we have to go down to the caverns again to actually find the lad. Uh, put that onto there. Oh no, it's here! It's And it's up in the bloody air as well. And presumably we just have to do the dance three times and get it. And I'll put that in my backpack. Dance. Again. Can I do it? Yes, it's it's close enough. Where's it gone? There it is. 
Oop. Fall damage. Good. Yes, didn't get fall damage because of falling off that cliff. Turns out my old, my previous lad is still working well. And we can put that into there and claim him. Nice. Get you and get the own. Get the own. Get the own. Oh, backpack full. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's it. I can pack everything up and go home again. Where's the bloody on gone? There it is. Uh, and then do our stuff. Um, but first, we may as well just have a bit of a go with Rogel. Produces power. So it's, oh, that's a mutant seed. I don't want to lose that. Grobal. Is that the one? Yes. Well, it went bong. It went, made a bong noise. Um, it's not the most exciting one, this. But I've already got an RTG in my backpack anyway. So we'll just have to take that one on trust, I think. And we are home. So, just need to actually um, claim a mission thing. Uh, this will be the terrarium for J Novus. And now we just need to do verification on both of our new lads. So a two for one deal here. Bung you in. And let's see what you look like in, in that weird water stuff. All very nice. And the other one, there. Oh, it looks like I just ran out of arm. Oh yes, because I took off the armor plating, didn't I? My armor. And you and all. Completed you. Nice. Claim the rewards. These are just basic bites. And the next one, overcharged. Uh, we need to provide two chips and provide more power and then use the data log. Um, so the farming wise, we just all we need to do now um, is... Oh, that's running out of whatever it was. Um, to do, start the farming, we just simply need to plant those things that we got. Um, plant. Hold some produce. And I did get another one, but I'm not quite sure where that other one went. I might have actually fed that to something at some point, but never mind. So that starts that, uh, which means we also have a reward for wholesome produce, which means we get a storage silo and a proximity repeater for probably automation nonsense. And there we go. Proximity, proximity repeater. Probably, I'm just going to automate some farming using that, but who knows? Nobody. Literally nobody. And there's a big fat medium storage silo. Ooh, that'll come in useful for our terrible storage solutions at the moment, which is a, a very, very terrible indeed. <laughs> Oh, cool. Okay, so we'll stop here. Um, we've done five snails now, so there's only a couple more to do, so I'm sure we'll finish that off in another video. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, bye for now.